Yes. Mm. This is Ike. I'm on the other Hey. Yeah. Hey. What My people. So My people. Pray for me. Hey. <laughs> Fantastically, we met a very good friend here. He's the guy with oh, 12 man. different dogs in this village. And the dogs oh, are just man. looking at us oh, to be sure that they are, our guy is safe. So he's taking us down into the farmland. And I believe we are going to have a fun time. Go and try and love. Test me in again, we let it rain. Keep on start us up. Keep on search us, we don't got it. Right now, I'm in the middle of nowhere. nowhere. Where? <laughs> but what we have here is uh, the palm front taken from the palm tree. This is how they bring it down. A single palm tree can give you up to seven palm front at a time, like this in bulk. When they remove like seven of these, within the next month, it would have replaced itself with this bunch that you are seeing or more. So that's the fantastic work of nature. The nature has a way of replicating itself for the betterment of human life. So let's dash into where they are plucking it off the palm tree. So we are beginning to enter into real farm land here, where a lot happens. A lot. Ah, Mama is already coming back. Ah, good, good. So that's Mama there, bringing a whole lot of palm fronds directly from the palm tree. And this is what I call the palm tree. Palm tree body from head to toe is actually one of the best money-making machine for we Africans because everything that relates to the palm tree speaks money. And it is only for us to develop it the best way we can by ensuring that our farmers are assisted to take care of their children so that they can be of immense help and benefit to their father's productive ability in the bush. And that is why we Cetros Blog and Cetros Foundation, we've decided to come to the bush and help out with our farmers. You can see for yourself what is happening here beautifully. This is, this is beautiful farm work. Up to 10 years that our friend there they call him pastor our friend there pastor has been doing this stuff and the way he was climbing this stuff is like the stack is there so i want to challenge him let me see if i can also <laughs> i know that you guys you will not expect me to do that if not you want me to <laughs> to have a serious collision and this thing okay they call palm tree here, they call it Ofe in Africa, in Yoruba language, the most outstanding people in the whole world. Awala Kaweju, Awala Jebaju. I don't want to delay him, he's doing much, uh, doing some other work. I was thinking that maybe he has finished so that we can just go to somewhere, maybe have a time to just drink, have a little drink. Say, Enobu, Enobu Mawa, and Bibai. Oh, wow. Enobu Mawa. So, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Amari, hey, he said we should have come early in the morning. You see what they call bush meat. I actually asked him to show us his climbing skill on the palm tree, and it was so thrilling. Sir, we thank you very much. Let me see, let me try my own climbing. My people, my people, pray for you. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hey! 
Eh? 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 Let us clap for this man because <laughs> it is not easy. I can't try it. <laughs> Anywhere in the world, whenever you are mentioning palm oil, this is the only source of palm oil anywhere. Regardless of whatever grammar they blow on it, it must just be processed in this manner. And like what you have here, what I'm holding is priceless. It's oily. If I just talk it, hmm. Hmm. Natural oil. You remember the food we had at the garage that is called Opa the Rice? And you remember they served it in a particular leaf? This is the leaf. This is where the leaf for the Opa the Rice packaging is produced. So we eat natural. This is the same leaf they use in making Moi Moi LM Image. You remember my video about Moi Moi LM Image? This is the leaf. When you wrap it like this, I want to munje say, hey, look at you. You put the moment there when you finish packaging it you bend it like this you have this one huh? 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 you have it like this these moats where you have um, what they call giant ants all those black ants that a single bite from them can reset your brain in case you are stubborn when you breathe here you breathe oxygen oxygen can you guess what we are holding? This is what I don't know the English name for this. This is what the Mahibo people, the Eastern Nigerians, use in making their soup called hogbolno. So this hogbolno fruit, there is a seed inside of it. I will show you that seed because I, I love cooking a lot. There is a seed inside of it that is used in making that draw soup. Wow. They must have discovered this during the war. And that's why Igbos remain the best foodies in Nigeria. They know how to prepare a whole lot of soup. They have the best soup in this country, Nigeria. Right now, we are jetting back to the village to go and meet the ladies that are into hair making and the one that is into fashion and any other persons there that we didn't feel that they are set for us to assist. Here we are. And in case any of them cannot meet up with our requirement now, we will chill, we will wait for them. They will, send, we will teach them how to send us video over there, back in Lagos, where we can look at what they are doing and get approval to sponsor them. That's it. So it's time for us to go back to what we call in our place. We call it Abba, Amlet. Go and try your luck, test me in again, we let it rain. Please don't start us up, that black and white they yin and yang. It's the office, please don't search us, we don't got a thing. Tell them park it up, then that ass be parking up. Please stop us parking up, like the fireworks, I keep the flame. Heard you barking up, it's the wrong tree, I got the strength. Yeah, I'm charging up, they can't keep up, got them looking drained. Now they walking up, trying to put the face to the name. I pull up and I scrap, and I'm swerving. If a nigga try to holler, she gon' curve him. We came from under rugs like a Persian. We've been staying.